Welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Quest Swords. Last time, remember? Well, we had one hell of a start of a new, of a new game. Now, before we actually go to the um, to the castle, I'm going to show you around the place. What you see here. This is the item shop. Of course, over here, this is my house. And as I mentioned before, <coughs> you can find some, you can find little things, just, just, just small little things around here. Now we would go a little ways right. Here we'll find the weapon shop, the item shop. <coughs> and going up a little further to the next spring, we'll find the pub. That was why does everybody in Dragon Quest have to sound so British? I found myself thirty dudes. Actually, it doesn't matter which way you go because it's, it's going to take you to the castle any which way. Well, the one thing we are going to be doing. I'm showing you the ways around town because this is home base. This is this is your home base. So go up here. This is where you can actually go and save. This here is the church. This is where you can save. I'm gonna touch you all now. And now she seems rather low to show her face just lately. I'm a bit worried that she might have caught cold. Maybe something more serious. Doubtful. Now there are other ways around town, but that will be shown much later. But anyway, since I've already shown you the the way of this place, um, I think it's on time we go to the castle. Oh, a bit fishy if you ask me. But nobody didn't ask you. I came all this way after hearing about that Prince Amos is a bit of a looker. But they won't let me inside the castle. They told me outside so I aren't allowed in. But I reckon they're trying to keep something secret. Maybe. Present circumstances, unfortunately, dictate that entry to the castle must be restricted. Oh, oh sorry, Ismus. I didn't realize it was you. It's your 16th. It's your 16th today, isn't it? Feel free to go on in, then. Thank you. All this on your 16th birthday. Hi there. Of course, today's your 16th birthday, isn't it? 
ordinarily you'll be granted an audience with Her Majesty, but she appears to be a bit under the weather again. I wish I knew what was going on. Felicitations, birthday boy. Sir. So, how peculiar for you to be visiting the castle alone. Oi. Uh, you know how it is. I imagine you're here to meet with Mother. Yep. How unfortunate. She's made it quite clear that she does not wish to entertain visitors at present. I just want to say hi. She has even refused to grant me an audience. Her own son. Sorry. I am desperately worried about that. Who wouldn't be? Your Highness, I trust all is tickety-boo. Ah, Minister Misericord. My young friend here is celebrating his 16th birthday today. Accordingly, he has come to an audience with Mother. Aha, uh -huh. I see. Uh, unfortunately, the Queen is somewhat <coughs> unavailable. I can know that. Yes, this does give rise to a most vexing dilemma. What to do? What to do? Ringo, I have it. I shall momentarily assume the role of Her Majesty and convey the procedure of the hawk in her place. Really? Excellent, Minister. I myself must away. Training beckons, you understand. So I shall leave this matter in your capable hands. I shall come, if I may, somewhat directly to the... Uh, yes... To the uh, point. <laughs> As you have now come of age, you are required to undertake the walk of the worthy. That's what I'm here for. It is a long standing tradition of the Kingdom of Avalonia. A trial to establish your merit, if you will. Yeah. Beyond the plains to the north, you will find the notorious. Caliburn Cave. Is that bad? The walk of the worthy merely requires you to return safely from its innermost chamber to the worth of worth. I have little doubt that you, one of Avalonia's most promising young talents, will succeed and return triumphant. Hmm. to go, I will go where you need me. I went there because it's my birthday, you dumb bitch. I know you want to get into the prince's, into the prince's hands, but I'm sorry. I merely went to Go and do something. It was my birthday after all. Shit. So now we're supposed to make our way to the town gates. How you doing? Hello there, young man. The Colonel told us you'd be heading out of town today. You're off to take the walk, aren't you? Yes, sir. Right. Well, I'd better open the gate then. Thank you. That's what I'm about to do, Dad. I'd like to say I'll go with you, but uh, that wouldn't make it much of a trial now, would it? No, it wouldn't. No, lad. This is something you've got to do on your own. I'll be thinking of you, though. 
I may even remember to raise a glass to you down the pub. Yeah, drink two down for me, would you? <laughs> Typical Claymore. Same as ever. Is he really the same as ever? Well, good luck on the walk. Just follow the path across the plains and you'll be at Caliburn Cave before you know it. Okay. So, we're off to head towards the first of many trials ahead of us. The first is Caliburn Cave. The cave beyond the northern plains of Babylonia, where the walk of the way awaits our hero. So, I am going to the northern plains. When you're HP close to zero, you'll be transported back to town with half of the goal you were carrying. And say, oh, hey, no one is going to explain it in the menu. It's like returning to town to make a quick getaway, but they'll not only save your life, but half your money, too. If I haven't shown you that, this is what you do. That's all I'm doing. You shall be fodder for my sword. Yeah. Yeah, make sure you check every so often on on um certain items or certain things that look a bit strange or like the Oh, 
feel like we're coming up to the cave. Welcome to Caliburn Cave. Glad to be here. There's no mistaking a son of old Claymore, is there? I mean, look how easy you've got here. Yeah, I know, right? But this is just the start of the walk of the worthy. Are you ready for the true test ahead? Bring it. Great. Well, here are a few things to help you on your way. Use one if things get hairy in there. Thank you. Three men, three herbs. What then? Three mints and orders. May the goddess be with you. I pray that she will see you safe through the challenges that lie ahead. What's that supposed to mean, sir? Don't you know I came from the blood? I, I come from the blood of Loto from the first Dragon Quest game. Now, entry had to be the key. Oh, how about that? I drank it. Come on, I'm ready for you guys. I told you I'm ready for you guys.
Lovely lucky bags. You will find lucky bags as you fight your way through the wilderness, but their contents will remain a mystery until you return to town. When you finally do, you'll be able to look inside one the lucky bags you found on your travel. Even if you go back to town early or fall in the field, you'll you'll still get to keep your lucky bags. make this quick, shall we? Well met, seeker of worth. Behold this knight of old, Sir Dirk Worthington. At least you're not Dirk the Daring. A duel, sire. That is your charge. Defeat me, and take your place amongst the ranks of the worthy. Oh, that no. Battle without quarter. Come on! Touché, sir. 
on God. Show me your word. Am I worthy now? That was a rank C class. Word of his misheroic deeds has spread, and 22 more people have now heard of him. So now I am a worthy apprentice. You can now check your title and renown from the spare screen. Inside the looking bags are found boxer shorts and hardwood headwear. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stop here, and in the next part, I'll see you in the next chapter, hopefully. So, I'll see you next time.